I wasn't going to say anything, but uh, <laughs> <laughs> felt sorry for Uncle Pat. All these stories about Uncle Pat. So I have nothing but great fond memories of Uncle Pat. <laughs> <laughs> I just tell a couple of brief stories. I, I have nothing but great memories of Ohio and my grandparents. Um, Grandpa Ted just spoiled me rotten. And every time I came, it was just a, a special time. And, uh, Uncle Pat, he just cared for me and was my babysitter. And we had so many good times. I remember Grandma, she always wanted to make sure I ate my greens. <laughs> and she was a, you know, as everybody that ate there you knows, she was just a fantastic cook. And I remember, you know, some of the times that I spent there with plant gardens, and uh, Uncle Pat would try to let me, as a little toddler, help him plant. And I remember. He gave me some corn seed. You know, we were supposed to plant this corn seed so far apart. And I got the idea that that just took too long. So I just started spreading the seed. <laughs> and after a little bit, Grandma turns around and she sees <laughs> and she says, Pat, weren't you watching him? <laughs> Pat said, well, he was doing okay for a little bit. He looked away for a minute, and I messed it all up. Another memory that sticks in my mind, well, a couple memories. I remember the outhouse, too. But um, another memory is Pat was always bringing critters up to the house, and uh, I think he caught a, a chipmunk one time. I remember that. And... I was well warned to leave the chipmunk alone. I think Uncle Pat was told to go turn it loose or something. Well, I went out there in that area looking for it, and I found it. And uh, I got a hold of it, and it got a hold of me. <laughs> and I don't know if it was punishment or it was my well-being, but Grandma got the uh, alcohol out. <laughs> pretty well cured me of wanting to grab a chipmunk. <laughs> but, uh, in my teen years, I'd come and visit sometimes during the summer uh, by myself, and we always, cousins would get together and had a good time, <laughs> Jennifer and Jimmy, and we uh, have a lot of fond memories. So I just wanted to mention a few little highlights of my younger years. I remember you there playing the games Christmas time, and you remember the Crossfire game? Yeah, and I almost mentioned that. That was something that stuck in my memory too. You got that, you got that Crossfire game. I, I think didn't my dad give that to you for Christmas, or do you know who? Don't really remember. Anyway, it, it was a game that was a lot of fun, shooting the little ball bearings and bagging each other. Really Cross just, the board game. Was, yeah. yeah, we had a lot of fun. I think everybody got some. <coughs> Photos of that too. Caesar's Creek. Yeah. <laughs> Grandpa used to take us swimming. We would uh, sometimes get in some scrapes we shouldn't have. <laughs> get in over your head. Yeah. I wouldn't be sitting here today if it wasn't for Keith. I almost drowned at 14. Grandpa taking us down there and yeah, we got into some water over our heads. 